Wow, it even electrified the map somehow. Welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. On the last episode, I had reached the Ocean King Temple. And now I believe it's time to press forward with said temple. Whoa, look, Metro Met Metroid Junkie. Looks like someone's skeleton. What is it doing here? You don't think this could be Lineback? This is really starting to creep me out. I don't blame me on there. Hello. I foolishly entered this temple. In moments, it drained the life right out of me. So even if you clear a trap, it resets once you leave. I should have made notes on my map, but I couldn't make notes on maps that have these I icons. I enter the temple in search of the treasure, but monsters that cannot be slain with a sword stalk the corridors. Wait, if they died, how did they manage to make their way out here? Were they in a state of, were they just simply fatally wounded and then they managed to crawl their way out here? And then they proceeded to become skeletons? Hey! Wait! Did you hear something, Link? Hey! Okay, I definitely heard something, didn't you? Hey, there's someone over there, Link! You, kid! Over here, kid! I'm talking to you! You came at the right time! You're lucky you found me! Lucky for me, but luckier for you! Now help me! Oh, him? That's Lineback! Hey, are you listening? I said help! What is he screaming about? For someone pleading to be saved, he sure is rude. Would you say? Oh, it's that Chetty Fairy from the old man's place. Yes, I got it. Listen, can you help me out? Just pay attention to what I have to say. I know you're a kid and all, but try to listen up. I'm trapped in here and I don't know what to do. Normally I'd free myself without any problem, but I sprained my ankle and I cannot move. Will you help? Sure. I knew you'd come through for me, kid. Well then. Do something about these pointy spikes. There's got to be a way to disarm the trap somewhere around here. Fine, Lineback, just wait there. Let's help him out, Met Link. I keep forgetting. Oh, hey, wait a second. There's something I forgot to tell you. I'm trying to give him sort of a Frenchman accent, but then... One thing you should know about this temple, it'll suck the life out of you. Why didn't you tell us that sooner? That's pretty important, you know. Let me finish. Don't go running away yet. I know it's scary, but it's not like the temple will suck the life out of you all the time. I'm not sure why, but as long as you stand on areas like this, you'll be okay. Show me that map. See all those purple spaces? Those are probably safe zones. Were you listening? Did you get all that? Keep your strength up, kid. Don't be shy about the breaking pots. Now get me out of here. I can feel the burn already. You're welcome. Are you kidding me? That little boy did it! Okay, I'm taking that as my cue to get on out of here. Freedom! You know, for someone with a sprained ankle, he sure is running fast. I guess freedom will do that to you. Whew. I think we can take a quick breather. Hey, you said you sprained your ankle. You're walking just fine. Technically, he was running. You said you needed our help. Here's the badass music. Bah! It's not like you're the one who did the saving. Hey kid, you're pretty brave for someone so short. I mean, not as brave as me, but not too shabby. So your name's Link, huh? That's a weird name. The name's Linebeck. I'm a real man of the sea. Impressive, huh? It was smooth sailing for me in the beginning, 
But then I got myself stuck in that trap. This place will suck the life out of you if you let it. Blasted temple? What are you doing in a place like this anyway? And what do you want from me, kid? I love how Link is talking. What? You were looking for the ghost ship? So you're trying to get your mitts on the treasure? Treasure, what are you even talking about? Link is trying to save his friend. She was abducted by the ghost ship. We came hoping you might know no more about it. Oh, really? Ooh, how sweet. They think I'm going to cry. Oh, I'm just teasing, kid. If that's what this is about, I'm on board. I'm here looking for info about the ghost ship, too. It was just a step away, but I sprained my ankle. Otherwise, I would have explored this cursed place. Liar, I just saw you running like a rabbit. No, no, you didn't. That was just a delusion. My ankle's still throbbing. The pain is unbearable. Oh. Oh, the pain. Anyway, they want to know more about the ghost ship. Go on without me, kid. Go grab the clue about the ghost ship. It has to be in there. We need it to find the ship. Got that? You're faking it. I think you're just scared. Uh, I think Link's not looking so good. Not a chance. Normally, I'd be leading the charge down there. But I know how much it means to Link. I'm letting him have the glory of saving his friend. Also, I don't want to get trapped anymore, but that's beside the point. So anyway, here. Take this with you, kid. I found this key around here. It might help. <laughs> Link, are you okay? You got a small key. We'll open a locked door. Tap the locked door to unlock it. And maybe you'll get your senses back one of these days. You'll know what you've got to do, so get to it! Oh, and uh, good luck in there, kid. I love how Link's shadow is glitching out, but Linebex isn't. Maybe I should do something about that curse. Ah, who, who cares? Ah, right. Well, that was simple. I think there are hearts literally sprained everywhere. Ah. Wait, what? Ah, okay. Wow, that makes it even worse. Ouch. This isn't good. Excellent. Burning is. The burning means it's helping. You found a sea chart! Yeah, you have to go in there here four times once to get each sea chart. I don't think it's as bad as some people say. I mean, yeah, it is pretty annoying that you have to keep coming back to this temple, but it's not that bad. It must be an important clue to finding the ghost ship. You should show it to Linebeck. Whoa, look at that old sea chart! I wonder if that's the clue to the ghost ship Linebeck was talking about. Probably. I mean, I'm not an expert, but if I had to venture a guess... Probably, yeah. Feel the burn, Link. Feel the burn. Hey! Where's Linebeck? Can you believe the nerve of that guy making us go in here by ourselves? Now that we've got the sea chart, I've got some words for him. I'm sure you do. Although, maybe I should get something first. Yep, the Phantom Hourglass. Oh, I can't pick it up. It must be scripted. Yeah. Ah, right. <laughs> it's coming back to me now. Where'd line back? Oh, there you are. Oh, ho if it isn't the little monkey in this Twinkie Pal. Slow getting the goods, eh? While I ran like a brave man. Slow, how dare you? You were quick enough to run off injury and all. 
What an insult! I was merely hurrying back to my ship. Any captain worth his salt puts his ship before his own safety, I tell you. But tell me, little monkey, what did you find in the treasure chest? Ah, map! Let me add it! Bah! What is this? Some boring old sea map. Oh, now I see. It is, as we call it in the adventuring business, a treasure map. If we probe its mysteries, we can find the very prize I'm seeking, the ghost ship. And by we, I mean me. Farewell, little monkey, I'm off to find adventure. Did he really just do that? He must sit on our map, then runs off with it. What should we do next? Meet Lineback at his ship link? Well, it's not like we have any other choices, right? What a prick. I forgot what a prick he was. He's, he's lucky he's so lovable, otherwise, uh... I might just be tempted to uh, give him a little, uh, this. Wait, what? Okay, that was weird. It glitched out for a second there. It's like he got possessed. Okay, lineback. I'm coming after you. You just made enemies, friend. Well, look who's gracing our presence. It's old man Lucius. I'm not sure if lineback is talking or the fairy is. The bridge has been fixed, so I thought I'd check up on the youngsters here. You're an amazing lad to emerge alive from the temple, Link. Very courageous for one so early in his years. You sent me into that treacherous temple too, oh you old barnacle! Any who find into the temple unprepared will find it a terrifying ordeal, and most would lose heart and flee for their lives upon hearing me say it. But evidently there are true heroes among us. Preen my feathers a little more, old man. Yep, yeah, I'm famous, all right. Not you, fool. You're a wreck. You'd be sunk right by now if our old young friend here hasn't sh had shown up. I was injured. On a typical day, I blazed through one or two such temples before breakfast. Calm yourself, Lineback, and tell me what you've made of the temple's map. I've inspected it fully. My trained eye finds that it holds no secrets at all. But wait, old man. What do you know of this map? Oh, ho, ho. has that map's puzzle eluded you, Lineback? If I may see the map. A standard map would simply show you where to go, would it not? This is no standard map. You'll find that one section's a little flaky. Touch it. I trust you can solve the puzzle, Link. Let's see. Is it that one? Is that part? No, it's not. Where is it? I'm stroking all across the map, but I'm not seeing a dang thing. Well, this is a little bit tricky. I haven't played this game in forever, so I've got no idea where I'm supposed to be touching this. I'm doing it all over. You probably can't tell because of the cursor not being recorded, but I am doing it everywhere that I possibly can, so I have no idea. All right, hang tight real quick. Ah, just had to keep doing it. Hey, look at that, a secret marked on the map. That marks the spot of an isle born of volcanic strife. It is, oh wait, sorry, I'm quoting the wrong guy. It is the Isle of Ember. A fortune teller named Astrid lives there, and she sees Farlink. So you should ask Astrid if she can see where the ghost ship might be. Isle of Ember, eh? I always suspected there might be something there. So it's as simple as sailing there and finding Astrid? So, we're off to Isle of Ember, then. Ciela, I'd like you to go with Link. It'll be essential to his efforts, I'm sure. And by seeing the outside world, you might just find your lost memories. That you used to be Navi. Uh, sorry, too early in the plot. Will do, happy to help. Sorry that we have to pal around with Lineback, though. Still, I'm glad to sail the seas and see the world. What? Don't tell me that I have to haul around that twinky bit of the fluff, too. Bah, fine then. 
Okay, the Isle of Ember awaits. Ready to sail, Link? Hmm, you'll be live bait with only that sword. Surely you should have a shield before we leave? Okay, fine. I'll wait here. Hurry up and get ready. Okay, I guess there's a shop somewhere that I can use to buy this elusive shield. Okay, that's the tavern. Obviously, that's not the place. What about you? Just some guy's house that I ran into without permission. But then again, this is a... This, I am an action-adventure hero. I can do whatever I want. If I had to guess, it's probably this one. Yeah, probably. Welcome, shopper. How can I help you? That's a wooden shield. It protects you from light attacks. It's just 80 rupees. You got the wooden shield. Defend yourself from minor attacks just by holding it. Thank you very much. Hmm. Interesting. No deal. Ooh, some bombs? Oh, you don't have a bomb bag. I can't sell bombs to people without bags. Well, that's too bad. I don't have a bomb bag. But I am the bomb. I'll see myself out now. Oh yeah, eventually you can get ship parts. I remember that much. Make your way with caution, Link, and take good care of Ciela for me. Okay, the Isle of Ember awaits. Ready to sail, Link? Then climb aboard. The open sea calls. You know it. It's off to the open sea with us, then. I'll leave all the navigation to you while I stay down in the engine room. Tap the feather pen icon to access your navigation chart. Just draw a line and the ship will follow that exact path. Try it out. Look at this. Dang. Well, I guess I can't look around until it's already started moving. Check this out. And we're off. Oh, almost forgot. See the engine on the right? Tap stop to go to stop. To resume course, tap go. Well, to see if you want to look around the sea, touch the screen's edge. Stay alert up there. Touch up, down, left, and right to look in all directions. Check it out. There's the island we just came from. It does look really cool, doesn't it? Ooh, golden frog. Too bad we don't have a cannon. Yeah. Looks really nice, especially for the DS. You gotta appreciate all the little detail here. There's a crane on that island. It's so beautiful, isn't it? Even the music is pretty awesome. This must be the Isle of Ember that Grandpa was talking about. We're here! There's a lot of monsters here, which means Linebeck is just going to stay in the ship. A sterling example of my helmsmanship in Press Link. What? You didn't even know where the island was. Who sketched our cart course on the sea chart? Yeah, Link did. What? You piece of fluff. You just don't appreciate the finer points of sailing. But you get me, right, Link? No. <laughs> Abuse your captain, will you? Okay, you little adventure monkey. Why don't you run off and find Astrid? I'll be right here waiting for you, taking care of my ship. Hm. What's staying behind? You're scared, aren't you? Me? S -s 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 scared? I'm never s -s scared, you little fluttering shrimp. You two go ahead. I'll be breaking my back working on the ship for your sakes. Sure. I believe you. I believe that you believe that. But do I believe that you believe that you actually are being honest with me? Probably not. Weird. These houses are ominously quiet in here. I could read that to get some more insight, but I don't think I'm going to be doing that. I'm just going to go straight ahead. There you go, you little freaks. I forgot. I, I decided to go with a system of just using the, 
directional pads to move and instead of using the face button, I'm just gonna use the touch screen for that because it seems like the best balance, in my opinion. Because this clearly was not made with directional pad in mind. It's much easier to hit them if you're using the touch screen. A fallen adventure! Look, Link! Yep, a clue. Brute force! We'll get you nowhere! Ha! Ah, it's a ghost! Get him, Link! Huh? Wait! Give me some warning before you come at me! I must look really bad, but I swear I'm not a bad ghost! Well, to be honest, he doesn't even- he doesn't really look like an evil ghost. My name is Ko. I used to work for Astrid, the fortune teller. What happened to you, you poor thing? If you believe in fate, then it's not so bad. I do feel much lighter. Of graver concern, though, is what happened... What's happened to Astrid? It haunts me. Astrid, we came to this island to find her. Do you know where she is? I hid her away. Astrid is inside her home right here. But there's no way I can open the door. Not in this condition. Would you please open the door for me? Of course it'll help. We'll open that door and let Astrid out. I'd really appreciate it if you could do this. Now here's the secret to opening the door. The three torches on the island are the key to understanding. Keep that in mind, you may be able to open the door. Okay. I see. Where's that map? Right here. I'll just mark it with a T. Because I guess that's what I gotta do. Every time I see a torch, I gotta mark it down on the map. The old map. I swear I remember passing another torch, though. Maybe I just imagined it. <laughs> Probably not. Oh. It's right here. Wait, what? Uh-oh. that shield, huh? My mech was actually bright. Ouch. Jerk. There we go. I'm no closer to my goal, though. Unless... Hang on, Link! I feel a presence on the other side of this door! Hey, I hear footsteps behind there! But this door looks pretty locked to me! What should we do? Hey, let's call out! Ready? Okay, call out something now! Loud and clear! Oh, boy. Crap, I forgot what button I did specifically for this. Right, okay. Hey, back there! Who? Who's there? Someone heard you! You did it, Ma Link! Are the monsters gone? Get me out of here! It's safe out here! Kaio asked us to open this door, so might you be the fortune teller Astrid? Indeed, I am Astrid. Yes, but as a favor to Kaio, to look at the map hanging beside the door, simply touch it. I don't know who you are, but would you open this? Thank you, and good luck, because this will be tricky. I see. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna guess. Well, I got one of them right. Hey! Don't tap just anywhere. Mark only the location of the three torches. Okay, I guess I gotta go actually hey. find them now. Should've known. Well, at least I got most of the way there. Now I just gotta find the torches. How simple could it be? Ouch, okay. Wow, it even electrified the map somehow. As if the map itself is digital. Oh, you prick. Well, at least I found the location of another one. That's two out of three. Not too bad, if I do say so myself. Oh, that was 
was a good one. That's a good one. Dang it. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. You jerks. I'm not doing so good. Link is, uh, losing blood here. Probably. I have to assume he is. Dang it. Everywhere is jerks, jerks, jerks. Jerks, jerks, jerks. Yeah, not so high and mighty now, are you? gonna start slamming into trees out of anger. Nice. Well, uh, at least I'm fully healed now. More or less. Now I just gotta find that third torch. Wherever it might be. You know what that means? Hang tight. I can't believe I forgot about this. There was a torch right in this freaking house here. I knew I remembered a torch. Just for some reason, I convinced myself that it was outside that I remembered it. Maybe I should have lent myself to new possibilities. Instead of just assuming that it couldn't possibly be that. Well, what matters now is that I found it. I'm going to be a little like Linebeck and just say, uh, it doesn't matter. Indeed. This, this, and this. Ta-da! You touched the right places! <clears throat> Thank you for opening the door. I'm finally free to go outside again. You best of the monsters who guarded me. You, So you are no ordinary travelers. May I ask your names? Of course. Link! It evokes kindness and strength in the same breath. Lovely name. Now tell me, what brought you to our island? A ship. Link is looking for his friend who was taken by the ghost ship. Astrid, we were hoping that you might have some insights. Is that so? The ghost ship came to our island a few days ago. That's why I was hidden away to escape its ruinous reach. Speaking of which, I haven't seen Kao since then. Astrid, about that. Well, Ko, he's... I see. I sensed it. Just as I foresaw, but it was destiny. Well, life has little use for mourning, so Ko thought. Shall I tell you your fortune? Sure. Please wait for me upstairs. If any others are with you, please bring them along with you to my chambers. Assemble yourselves, and I will join you after I make preparations. <laughs> okay, then. Confound it. You'd think that someone who sees the future would be on time. Where is Astrid? Let's get our fortunes told and be done with it. Greetings. Now if everyone is here, we can begin. Open my eyes to the future, a sinister darkness, the mighty sea, and the voice of sacred light. I see it. I shall speak. Listen with your hearts. If you really want to find the ghost ship, Link, you must be ready to clash with the very darkness itself. Knowing that, do you still want to rescue Tetra? Yes. Oh, very nice. The honesty in your eyes is crystal clear. Now make haste to the Temple of Fire on the summit of this island. There you must defeat the power of darkness that haunts this place. You will then find what you need to open the path that lies open before you. You have it within you to alter our doomed course of events, Link. But the light that seeks your help is growing faint. Please hurry. Power of darkness, eh? Hey, kid. I, uh, just remember that I have to go polish the, <laughs> the sh ship's rudder. Yeah, that's it. Uh, later, kid. Sheesh, what's with Lineback? Okay, let's just let him be and hurry to the temple. I assume this means I have the fortune teller's permission, which means that the gate will open and not electrify me. That's it, right? That's what this is, right? Yep, it's no longer electrified. Okay, we can reach the symbol of fire at the peak through here. Come on, tap the door to open it, Link. 
Nice. I don't think so, you little freak. My health is at full. There's no reason for me to even tango with those fools. Unfortunately, I'm out of time. Look, the volcano's erupting. Watch out for falling rocks. And watch out for outros, unfortunately. Until the next time, that is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like falling rocks. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.